Howdy, folk, and welcome to the Wild Wild West. This is a new playthrough for Red Dead Redemption. I actually sat down tonight to play Dragon's Dogma, but issues with HDCP protection did not permit me to do so. Instead, I thought, well, I want to play an open world game tonight, and I realized I bought this game months ago, and I never bothered to play it. So, this seems like a good as time as any. It also doubles as a great test for my new capture card. So, this is Red Dead Redemption, coming at you at the best quality I can give you. I'll preface this by saying I've never played this game. I didn't hop on the bandwagon all them years ago when this game was released. But, I have heard heaps of praise put on this title. They say it is Rockstar's best open world game to date. I don't want to see if that's true. So, let's start playing! Now, as usual, I like a game when it's hard. So I'm going to try out this hardcore mode. I think this is unique to the Game of the Year edition, and that's what I'm playing. So, let's jump in here. Alright, let's start a new save. I'm going to be honest with y'all. Cowboys weren't really my thing. I'm a samurai style of dude, but I watched the Man With No Name trilogy and I was bored to tears. So I got turned off to cowboys, but I did watch one cowboy movie that really inspired me to play this. And that was an Australian Western called The Proposition. But that's here near there. Let us go and start a game. Exodus in America <laughs> With the cemetery in the background. We're gonna put a whole lot of bodies in there Oh all these fresh immigrants Irish no 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 they're dressed too nice to be immigrants Ah, There's my dude <laughs> All the ladies looking over each other's shoulder to take a gander at this guy. Wow. This game's fucking gorgeous for an old ass title, too. Oh, can I rob these stagecoaches? No, no, no. That's a modern vehicle. That's not a stagecoach. <laughs> People believed it back then. Health benefits of smoking. Oh, are those my constables? Am I arrested? How did how to lay it is? No, I don't even bother to look at them. I'm all business, and I'm pretty messed up in the face. Ah, oh, I'm getting into this. <laughs> I've been transported way back. When did the West? When was the West wild and lawless? 1600s? Early 1800s? That's more like it. That sounds reasonable. Actually, there was a game called Red Dead Revolver, I think. That was a prequel to this of sorts, but I never heard that it was good. So I ain't playing that. <laughs> Okay, I got a whole lot of character. Well, I for one am grateful, Mrs. Bush, that they are finally bringing civilization to this savage land. I could not agree with you more, my dear. My daddy settled this land, and I know he'll be looking down on us. Please, how we help the natives. <laughs> yes, they've lost their land, but they've gained access to heaven. Ah, uh, yeah, those heathen Indians. They didn't know a lick about Jesus or salvation prior to us. Father, do you mean unless an innocent receives communion, they're destined to go to hell? 
Uh, hardly seems fair. What I mean to say, Jenny. Ah, oh, Jenny, stop there with your reasonable arguments. difference between an innocent and a savage. I never thought of it that way. Yes, they lived like animals, but they're happier now. Oh, oh my God! All these self-important white folk. I want to shoot all of them. <laughs> Not only do people now have motor cars, Father, but I heard that pretty soon we will be able to fly. No, only angels can fly, Jenny. No, no, apparently people can fly. Didn't you hear? Yeah, they're a great studio. A man even got a car to fly. <laughs> I hardly think so, Jenny. A car to fly? I hope I meet a gentleman that does that. I hope that's an illusion. Apparently, Mr. Johns wants to run for governor. Which is why he's so concerned with cleaning up the state. Nate Johns. Yes. His family is nothing but hillbilly trash that came here after the war. <laughs> hillbilly trash. Want to be judgmental, but this Bitch, not please. Be You're being judgmental this whole trip. Family. A family without class. Apparently. The Johns family have made a lot of money, and he has a lot of friends in politics. Mrs. Bush, money isn't everything. There are many things that money cannot buy. It seems that money can buy voters, though. Mm-hmm. If only we put a cap on the spending elections back then. What you must remember, my dear, is that we have been brought here to spread the word. And the word and civilization, they are the same thing. They are the gifts. It is the opportunity we have, the chance to live among people who are decent and who do not kill each other. And who let you worship in peace. Uh, it, it's so confusing, Father. Sometimes I find it impossible to make the distinction between a loving act and a hateful one. I mean, they often seem to be the same thing. Yes, Jenny, it, it is confusing. But you only have to ask me if you need help. Indeed. Well, here we are, Mrs. Bush. Armadillo. Oh, we arrived at Armadillo Station. See, it's a loving act when we kill the engines. It's a hateful act when they kill us. Yep. Yep, that's the station. Oh, okay. Enough introduction. I control this dude. Will they tell me my name or will I be a silent protagonist? I don't know. I think he's more badass for being silent. Wait, yeah, yeah. I should hold... I should head over to the saloon. I did goof around in the multiplayer just a tad. To figure out the controls. Gosh. I get to explore all this. I love open world games. This will soon be, soon be my domain. But yeah, I, I, I goofed around in the multiplayer just to get the controls down a little. I figured them anyway. I played all of the GTAs, all the 3D ones at least. Let us go to the saloon. Howdy. Okay, I don't want to bust out my weapon. I know I can. Ah, oh, this is so cool. And I get... I can look behind myself and get the cinematic approach. What's happened, partner? Is the text? Oh wow, those are pretty high textures for paper. Fuck yeah, <laughs> the marvels of modern invention. Fuck flying cars. We got virtual machine boxes. Oh wait, no, I'm already on the train. Excuse me, I don't, I don't gotta go there. I came here for some reason, and my my purpose is the saloon. Okay, it's right there. Ooh, nice last up there. Yep. <laughs> town drunk. It's midday for you to be that tore up. Marston! Mr. Marston, over here! Ah, finally my name. I'm Mr. Marston. Howdy there, you old pervert. You must be John Marston. Sometimes. I'm Jake. Your friends from Blackwater hired me to guide you. They ain't my friends. I'm pleased to meet you, Jake. I got the horses saddled up and ready out front. Oh, you expect me to know how to ride them. <laughs> Little do you know. Play that ditty. I'll follow him in a moment. Shit. 
All right, so Jake, Jake contracted me. I guess the Blackwater organization existed back then. Oh, hell yeah, I did a Rockstar game without some prostitutes. Oh. Okay, okay, I'm coming, Jake. Shit. Okay, I'll get some pleasing later. Dang, what were prostitutes called in this time? I don't know, they had some old term for them. Are you walking to Fort Mercer, Mr. Marston? No, no, I'd, I'd rather not, but... Here, uh, let's mount up and okay, I guess you could teach me how to ride a horse. Really? Alright. Let's get on here. There we go. We'll just entire hey, from the post. Ain't no point in causing a ruckus. I, I want to accompany you. Don't leave me behind. Get, go, giddy up, goddammit. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I tap A. Okay, okay. Whoa. Just got to smack it on the sides with my spurs. There we go. That's a good gallop. And I hold... Oh, there we go. Even Jake's having trouble controlling his horse. So is Fort Mercy you want to visit? That's right. Ain't taking nobody up to the fort in a long time. Clean place for a decent fella to want to visit, if you don't mind me saying. Who said I was a decent fella? It's been abandoned for years <laughs> now. Folks say it was built during the Mexican War. What kinds of soldiers around back then? Why'd they leave? Well, I ain't entirely sure. I I heard they had to go up north to fight Indians, or maybe they got tired of being soldiers and went looking for gold. Oh, whoa, 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 you know way too fast. So what are you doing up at the fort? I'm looking for an old friend. Well, like I said, you ain't gonna find many folk around those parts these days. Those you do find about as sociable as an old three to back to. <laughs> I mean, I ain't one to judge a man by the company he keeps, but... Well, he ain't been friends for a long time. Okay, I think I'm hunting someone down. Mr. Marson's out here in the West for revenge. That's as good as reason as any. God, it's pleasant riding a horse. Any time in Armadillo, Mr. Marston? I doubt it. I ain't planning on staying very long. Well, if you're fixing for some female company, you can do a lot worse than Armadillo. Fine as cream gravy they are. Not like a <laughs> Dang, those girls ain't even fit for a drinking man to hold up with. I'm a married man, I'm afraid. Ain't we all? <laughs> <laughs> I like this Jay guy. Maybe I am wed? Oh, I know what happened. Probably this dude done killed my wife. And I'm seeking yeah. revenge. So it was the marshal who hired me. Lee Johnson, do you know him? I think I heard his name. Says he got a telegram from some Blackwater big bugs asking for a guide. I guess it's none of my business. That's right. Okay, so the marshal hired me. And Jake here is working as the guide for him. All right. Then I'm doing good for the land? I know this ain't you quite ain't GTA. Are you? Nope. I'm just chewing the dog, mister. It's how I am. I don't mean nothing by it. Trust me. There's things you're better off not knowing. Oh, look at that sky, though. Well, that's a I'll gorgeous you, 2D texture. Coyotes eat better than I do. <laughs> Not far now, Mr. Marston. The fort's just over this hill. All right, lead the way, Jake. Man, this is so pleasant. Oh, it really is. Okay, whoa, Bessie. Listen, mister. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang rode in and took the place over. So I understand. This is where we part ways, friend. You have yourself a good time. <laughs> <laughs> I know what must be done. Don't know much about this land or the armadillo town, but I sure know how to work a six shooter. All right, horsey, let's approach this yeah. shit. Is that a sign, or what is that? Damn, this actually makes me want to watch more westerns. Maybe I'll do that throughout this playthrough. Get, gain a little more knowledge about this lifestyle. What is that? Oh, it's a cross. I see. I thought it was a HUD indicator of some sort. Bad omen. Bill! 
Bill, you Bill, in there? I'll come for you. Bill Williamson! Come out here right now! That'd be a hell of an adventure if I Go get my revenge in the first now, mission. John. Don't make me kill you. Nobody needs to kill anyone, Bill. Oh, snap. You must think I was born yesterday. You always did think I was an idiot. No, I didn't, Bill. That ain't fair, Bill. You were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Do I look like I need saving? You can't outrun a bullet, man. They want to kill us all. I can help you. Well, you never tried to save me before. You only seemed to save yourself. Bill, you got such a half-assed voice actor. I implore you think about this. <laughs> you implore me? <laughs> you implore me. You always were one for fancy words. <laughs> oh. Well, things are different now, John. Now I'm in charge! No more Dutch! <laughs> and look what you've done with yourself. And no more you. <sighs> implores. I, I implores you to go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. Oh, you done fucked up, well. Bill. Ah, oh, come on, Nadja. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Jim. Dang, medicine wasn't all it's cracked up to be back then, John. The vultures are gonna get you. Betsy, come for me. You stupid son of a bitch. This is my main character. Well, better he starts off at his lowest point. Well, I'm glad some people give a shit about me. I must have dragged my ass over here, because that's sure as shit not where he shot me. <laughs> Help me, strangers! I know not what I've done. Obviously, Bill's a fucking dick. Fuck that guy, man. May the Lord save his soul, because I'm going to send him there. Soon as I get healthy. Wow. Great mission. <laughs> I rode a horse. I went to a saloon. I saw some call girls. Ah, oh, this lovely blonde. Alive. That dirty blonde from the train. So it would seem. So, how do you feel? I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? I was... Oh, I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us $15. Oof, that's a fucking fortune back sorry, then, I, I guess. Should have left me there to die. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county? To die, Mr. Er, Mr. Uh, Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarlane. Miss Bonnie McFarlane. Well, pleasure to meet you, you Bonnie. You're right, Miss McFarlane. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? Yeah, your descendants ended up drawing real good Mr. comic Williamson books. A chance. For old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Well, what was he like? Just no. as much of a dick. Just like you. <laughs> Thank you, miss. <laughs> you seen my hat? I have. And, uh, what will you do now? Kill that some bitch. Now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic. Just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch to run. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later? Help me patrol the perimeter. Uh, it'd be a pleasure to ride with you, Bonnie. On doctor's bills. Of course. 
And thank you for saving my life, I mean. Next time, Mr. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. I'll bear that in mind. I owe the lady. I gotta work off my $15 debt. I'll work on a ranch for a while. Oh. Hell yeah! Okay. I'm worse for wear, but... Lovely bonnet. Oh, I'd love to join her. Fuck yeah! This game is the shit already. And it's the perfect game for me to use all them years I'd worked at Cracker Barrel. And develop the fucking... Developing a southern drawl. Careful, mister! Alright, all these fucking work hats don't respect me. Okay, I could run around. Oh, wait, running. Okay, that hurts. Now, where is Bonnie? Oh, what is this? Oh, he's making steel. Or sharpening. That's pretty cool. Oh, are them chickens? No, it's just some dude. Now, where is Bonnie? Well, I guess I gotta go look for her. Oh, there are chickens. Do I have my gun? Oh, I do. Okay, let's not let's not pull that out. Ain't no reason for that. Unless we find the chickens. <laughs> oh, is this it? Oh! <laughs> I can kick the chicken! One more time. Shit. Yes! Every time I kick a feathers, come out. Move, chicken. Fuck. <laughs> And then they're gonna come out and attack me for that. Okay. Enough kicking chickens. <laughs> Where is this lass? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I have an indicator on. This is fucking GTA, man. Oh, okay. Crouch works. The blue indicator. Is a sign of where she is. How do I see my chaos? Okay, select shows me all my stuff. I could make a campsite, a basic one. That's about it. Hola. There's no button to just chat with people. Oh, there is. Hola, senor. Oh yeah, I can hold V to, to tip my hat at people. Well, Let me go in here. There. How are you, friend? Hey, partner. Well, That's I'll awesome. All right, you got anything to help me out? Maybe some cucumbers? No, I can't buy shit. I don't have any money. I don't got nothing. Let me go meet this woman. Can I run kick? Oh, I can punt this bitch. Oh, wait, what? Okay, wait, wait. Let me get a running start here and I can punt him. Dang it. I can't do it while running. Come on now. Oh. <laughs> That's pathetic. Yo, you got an issue with that? Howdy. Hello. Man, can I say hi to the chickens? Wait, you gotta get on its level. Ah, oh, no, it doesn't like me. After all, I, I said hello in the rudest way possible. Okay, here's our house. Fuck going the normal way. We <laughs> unnecessarily climb the fence. Mr. Marston, back in the land of the living, I see. Figured it's about time I started paying back that $15. Well, no time to waste. The horses are saddled up over here. Oh, okay. This is Bonnie right here. She was she was half expecting me. All right, Bonnie. Oh, of course. I'd love to focus on Bonnie and that fine the fanny. Office. It's also where we lock up good-for-nothing outlaws such as yourself. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. Hop on up. He won't God. Ride. This game's so yeah. fucking gorgeous. Alright, alright, I'll show you how to ride a horse. Come on then. I'll show you around the property. <laughs> Are we gonna take the horse inside, can I? Hold up. I wanna yeah, you're gonna show me around the property. But I want to look inside the pro- Aw, oh, god damn it. Horses don't know how to climb stairs. Come on. Your ride is the general store. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Very convenient. I don't think I've ever seen a ranch with its own store before. Nope. 
Try to keep Unique up, to a video you? game. Woman, I'm right here. <laughs> what you hollering for? Dude, get the fuck out the way. I'm gonna run you over. Don't you see I'm riding with Bonnie? And here's the corral. This one's for the horses. What do you think? I'm no expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. <laughs> I suspect you've stolen more horses than you've broken. Now where'd you get such an idea? First impressions are hard to erase. Oh lord. It hurts to ride the horse. All that motion That's the train station. upsets sure my injury. Since the line finally got finished, bringing in all sorts of new folk like yourself. Is that such a bad thing? Change is only good when it makes things better. Oh, I can hold A and it, it'll follow from then on out. I don't gotta keep holding A. That's to make, or maybe not. That's to make like shootouts pretty dope. I don't That's gotta worry about that. Yeah. There. Paul built it himself when I was just a little girl. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are we stopping? You stopping on, for? Mr. Marston, pick up the pace. All right, all right. I'm sorry. Pretty embarrassing if an, if an outlaw like me can't c keep up with and a girl. Here we are, back at the house. Let's stop for a while before we head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarland. All right, let's tie up the horses. Oh, I hit him. Awesome. You can only save one horse at a time. I think that's something to do with hardcore mode. I tried to read the differences online between normal and hardcore, and I think it made it harder to keep a horse. I'm all for get making the game tough. After all, the West was a dangerous place. Uh, oh, wait, 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 no. My indicator says I gotta go over there. But then why do you just kind of chill here? Maybe I had a mission I didn't really recognize, but I gotta go in here. Mister? Howdy, mister. Back home, the bacon was sweeter than it is out here. Wait, wait, I hitched the horse. I think he's just telling me to hitch the horse. Or is it? Oh no, I'm gonna go up here. Oh, this is cool. Oh, this is this is fighting stance. All right. And then I can shoot from up here if I wanted to. Okay, let let me not point the gun at people. They're gonna freak out. Unlike GTA, I don't want to cause mass violence. Well, to the right people. Oh. <laughs> I love the jump. All right, so what the fuck? Bonnie, I, 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 I hitched the horse. Are you not satisfied? Come on, get in the house. I'll force you in there. Fucking A. Really? Really? Get in the house. What the hell? Bitch, please. What are you made out of? Rubber? What is this? Just knock it into you. Get in the house. These women don't know their place. In 1800 America, your place was in here. Come on. Come on. I actually want to knock you through the door. <laughs> like some true spousal abuse. Oh, here it comes. Get in the fucking house, woman. Oh, good lord. Do you not know how to work a door handle? I gotta do something with the horse. I'm aware. I'm aware, but I fucking want to do this. Get in there. I'll throw you in the damn window. All right, that obviously isn't working. Let's go to see the fucking horse. I swore I hitched it up. What is she telling me? I hitched this damn thing. Okay. Oh, I didn't hit X. I hit A. You're right. I did it. I'm sorry, Bonnie. I fucked up. There. Okay, that horse would have ran off. Oh, and the chickens. <laughs> that never gets old. How about a cold drink, Mr. Marston? Thank you, ma'am. Getting shot then riding a horse seems to take it out of you. <laughs> I could use a rest. Sure. Come on in. I'll show you the house and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. Show me the bedroom, baby. 
Ah, uh, you chauvinistic, misogynistic pig. Remember me telling you about the trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables? I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I want to see just who is trespassing on our land. Oh, I got free reign to it's shoot him? a fine weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. Oh, I'm sure it is. I'd love to see the skyline. That's about Come as pleasant on, as an introduction gets. And take a look around. Ooh, can I zoom in? Ah, uh, the sky could be a little better, better drawn. Although I love the amount of stars, man. You don't see this many stars anymore in the cities with all them artificial lights blocking it. But back here, back then, you could see pretty much every single star in the sky. Well, I can shoot from horseback? Pretty dope. Can I? Oh, killer! Can't wait till I try out the multiplayer. I feel a lot happier someone's along with me. I feel a lot happier now I got a rifle. Well, with your trigger itch and my feminine intuition, we should make quite a team. Oh, wait, how do I reload? Okay, wait, I, I can figure it out. Alright. Let's see if some people be trespassing on Bonnie's ranch here. We just shoot him dead? No warning? Look, just damn rabbits are at the crops again. Get down and give me a hand, will you? Oh, yeah, I can kill some rabbits. All right. Come on, then. Time to put that bloodlust of yours to good use. We gotta shoot him? Can't we just, like... Ah, oh, we can't. Oh, fuck me. I want to kick one. Hold up, hold up. Yeah, fuck this. We knife the bunnies. No, don't you... <laughs> Oh, good lord. I can skin it, practically. Alright, we can kill it with a knife. Amazing we actually caught the damn thing. Can I cut down a stock of corn? No, I can't. Alright, let's get on this. Let's get going. We've still oh, got impressive. Of to cover. I feel much better. Alright, I should switch my weapon yeah. back to the gun. Which is down the there. Rustler stealing our cattle? It's the rabbits. Our it ain't never easy living off the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city, become a lady of leisure. <laughs> is that what they're called? Come on, boy. Lady of leisure? Look out! Or is that a term for like high society? Get before they get to the animals. Oh shit! Ah, oh, got the son of a bitch. Oh, I missed. Reloaded that shit. Come on, they're headed for the chicken coop. Not the chickens! Come on, easy up there. Motherfuckers! Only I get to kick the chicken. Where'd they go? Nice shot. Oh, fuck yes. Oh, I scared the horse. Guns scare horses. Nah, you ain't getting away with that. Fuck that. Chicken might be dead, but so are you. Oh, I can't see him in the brush. Fuck yes. Oh, we kill more of them. You know, you can actually handle a rifle. It's something I've had a little experience in. Maybe Bill Williamson did get lucky after all. Luck didn't really come into it, miss. You're a useful man to have around the ranch, that's for sure. But don't think I've forgotten what brought you here. We'll do whatever we can to help you. I sure appreciate that, Miss McFarlane. <laughs> As I talk to my left, <laughs> at least project your voice towards where she is. I wonder how I sheath my we weapon. Are. I just want to do it for, like, role-playing sake. I can't seem to sheath my weapon on a horse, though. Ah, oh, come on. I'll, I'll hit you like this. This works. Back it on up. Back it on up, horse. What are you doing? Don't fight me. Don't fight me, Betsy. Oh, you fighting me. That's not how this is supposed to go. Thank you for your help, Mr. Marston. Makes me kind of happy I saved your life. Get some sleep, and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Miss McFarlane.
Okay, I think I turned out a save off, so it'd be wise to save here. Oh, and it changes the time of day. Okay. This has such a GTA vibe. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I gained fame and Deadeye level. And honor. I think those are gimped in the hardcore mode, so it's harder to be anybody. Okay, what outfit can I put on, though? Oh, wait, what? Oh, this is how I gamble at the big tables. I can afford all these, or no? I have a suit, and I have my regular outfit. Oh, when you get all these from completing objectives? Win a duel? Awesome! They're unlocked by doing cool things, not just like grinding away. Win, sell items. That's pretty neat. I'm gonna dress up in this game, but let's sleep.